Mike Tyndall shared an update as he and wife, Zara Tyndall, returned to the UK after spending the weekend at the Monaco Grand Prix. Speaking on his podcast, The Good, The Bad, and The Rugby, Mike shared that he had an unbelievable weekend. Mike also mentioned a very famous celebrity, leaving fans thinking it could be the start of a new friendship for the former rugby star. Get the latest royal news straight to your phone by joining our WhatsApp community. The father of three, who hosts the podcast with Alex Payne and James Haskell, said, I had an unbelievable weekend at the Monaco Grand Prix. From an interesting start on Friday to an epic go through the evening and get on the plane with Tom Holland on Monday. Alex then asked Mike, new best friend? Mike responded, no, no, not a new. I wouldn't say, I don't know, Tom, let me know, reach out. The 8 bombshell claims Prince Harry made about royal family in unearthed interview Mike then shared that he had spoken to the star, stating, has obviously a rugby fan and I had a good chat with him. He gets everything right. He added, Tom was, on the flight back with me and someone was like, can I have a photo? And he went, I'd love to mate, but it's probably not the right time now on the bus. And everyone goes, oh yeah, okay. Referring to Tom Holland as a really nice lad, Mike added, he does it in such a way has not true in any way, shape or form. Has just like, come on, it's an environment where Terry's a hundred people stood on a bus, it's not the ideal photo, it'll get you later. He gets it right. Prince William has some catching up to do in Wales as Charles was more attentive Mike, who was spotted talking to Tom at the star-studded event, posed for a picture with his wife, Zara. The couple, who have been married for almost 12 years, took a picture at the side of the track. Earlier this month, Mike shared a series of clips and pictures on Instagram from the King's coronation, which he attended alongside Zara. Mike shared the post following a few days after the coronation, also describing the celebrations as unbelievable. He captioned the post, It's been an unbelievable 10 days. He also hinted that the celebration had tired him out, by adding, time to sleep at the end of the caption.